So guess what? I'm back already because uh, I'm angry. Because I always am. I'm a salty motherfucker, as you'll probably be able to tell from every video I post ever. But I was just reading this shit. And it's been going on for a while. It's not the new shit. But it's Donald Trump's been gutting the EPA. A lot of agencies. But I'm, I'm talking about the EPA today specifically. Because what the fuck? Like, who does this shit? Like, climate change, it's real. They're, like, there's no debating that anymore. And anyone who does is either... They either have this a sinister motive to... Because I guess they want to destroy the Earth or something like that. I don't fucking understand. Or they're just unbelievably stupid. Because... A vast majority, a huge majority of scientists, it's something like, it's like 97%, 98% of scientists agree that global warming is real and caused by man. So like, there's no, there's no arguing against this anymore. And the people who disagree with it, they're a bunch of fucking, and the scientists, like, they're a bunch of, bunch of fucking fossil fuel loving cocksuckers who are on the payroll of groups like Exxon and Shell and these other bullshit oil companies. And it pisses me off. Because, like, 97% of scientists agree global warming is real and it's caused by man. That, that is the scientific fact. You can't argue this shit anymore. But somehow, most Republicans, most Republicans agree that climate change is not real. It's just... It's not happening. It's not true. It's not a thing. And it's 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 infuriating. Cause like like I said, they're either unfathomably stupid, like like rock level IQ, and not like the guy Dwayne the Rock Johnson, fantastic dude, love him, awesome guy. I'm talking like the actual fucking rock as a piece of stone. That's how goddamn stupid these motherfuckers have to be. You hear that? Or they're just evil. Like that's it. They're they're just evil motherfuckers. Who are willingly destroying the earth. Because look, look at the most, most of the people in the Senate, in the House, and the secretaries, and the judiciary, and the executive branch, they're not going to be alive when this shit fucks everyone over. They're going to be dead. They're like 150 years old already. They're going to be dead in a decade. They don't give a fuck about global warming because it's not going to hurt them. Yeah, it's goddamn infuriating. Because obviously, they, I guess they just fucking hate their kids. Like, that's the only thing I'm thinking of. They must fucking hate their kids. Like, they must... Grandchildren? Yeah, they're fucking cunts. Pieces of shit, right? That's what they must think. Because there's no other explanation for this shit. It's just... I don't understand. I really don't. Because it, it's... It's un, it's it's real. It's real. And and let's, let's engage them for a second. Let's just pretend, yes, global warming is a huge fucking hoax. Either way, it's still good to have clean energy because fossil fuels and other unclean energies, oil, coal, that shit, they release fumes and other gases into the atmosphere. And even if they don't fuck up the environment, they fuck up your lungs. They are carcinogenic. They can cause cancer. They can do all this fucked up shit. They can get into a water supply and fuck everything up. So let's pretend even if global warming's not real, look at all this other shit. All this other shit, which is real. It's definitely fucking real. You can get sick from this shit. You can die from this shit. So even if global warming's not true, why wouldn't you want to invest in clean energy? Because all these fantastic things they can give you. Less cancer. I, I'm sorry, I thought that was a good thing. Apparently, fuck poor people, whatever. And it's really, really upsetting all the fucking time how people are so stupid or so evil. Like, that's the only explanation I have. I'm, I'm sorry that I get this angry, but, like, of course, I, I made this channel so I can piss and moan and be a little angry bitch about shit like this. Because of... If, you, if we don't bitch about it, if we don't yell about it, if we don't get in the streets and fucking scream and protest about it, if we don't get in people's roads and block the streets and shut down businesses, no one's going to fucking pay attention. That's another thing. People say, oh, these protests are disruptive. That's the fucking point. They're supposed to be disruptive. They're supposed to get you to pay attention, to look at what the fuck's going on. And if you don't, if they don't accomplish that, then the protest fucking failed. That's just fucking fact pisses me off. 
And the EPA just got gutted. As I mentioned in the beginning before, we went on a huge fucking rabbit trail. Rabbit hole, chipmunk trail, whatever the fuck that was called. The EPA got gutted. Lost to something like a fucking quarter to a third of its budget. It's ridiculous. Because they don't give a shit about the environment. They don't give a shit about so much. And it pisses me off how they can be so unbe- unbelievably careless. How they can be so cold hearted about so much shit. I don't understand. It makes me mad. It really does. I don't know. Maybe they're just... Maybe this is like a master plan of theirs. I don't know. To convince people to care about the environment. I don't think so. Because if people cared... If if people gave a shit, Donald Trump wouldn't have been elected. 99% of the Republicans wouldn't be in office if people gave a shit about the environment. And I'm not saying the the Democrats are perfect. Democrats kind of suck dick. They... They're pretty shitty 99% of the time. They refuse to grow some balls and stand the fuck up about anything. That's why, even though I'm a leftist, I I fucking hate the National Democratic Party. They're a bunch of pussies. They don't got a goddamn spine. They don't stand up for shit. Fuck, a bunch of them went over and switched over and supported Gorsuch. What the fuck is that shit? A bunch of them voted for some unbelievably incompetent cabinet picks. Like, they were choosing Wall Street baker, bankers to over to be like the overseers of Wall Street banks. What the fuck? They confirmed Rex Tillerson. Pissed off. The environment's fucked. We're gonna go back to, like, pre-Clean Water Act, where the, you drank out of the stream and you fucking died of cancer in like a week and a half. It's bullshit. I'm pretty heated, if you can't tell. That happens a lot. I just, I don't understand how some people, how people voted for him, honestly. Because so far, he's pretty much failed to follow through on a single one of his promises. Like, like what the fuck? Like, you want to shake things up? There's plenty of ways to shake things up other than fucking nuking the place and just bringing in the same guy that you talk about how much you hate. Yeah, I get it. Donald Trump ain't a career politician. But he brought in all the same motherfuckers that establishment people would have brought in. Stop, stop pretending like you really struck a blow against the establishment. Like you, you're really taking on the man by voting for Donald Trump and band of motherfucking bitches. It didn't change anything. Brought in more of the fucking same. 